What made you choose biology as an A-level? Well, I really want to study neuroscience with psychology at university mm -hmm. and having a baseline in biology would be really helpful with that. Um, I also really enjoyed it at GCSE level, so it's really good to continue it in that way. It's helped so much with resilience and teamwork and all of that, so it's really, it's a good subject to be studying to continue on to university level. Yeah. Why did you choose biology A level? I chose biology because it's relevant to the course that I want to study at university, so I feel like it's preparing me now. How does it differ to GCSE? Uh, at A level, uh, the biology course is a lot more detailed and in-depth than it was at GCSE so with protein synthesis you go on to talk about um, how the DNA actually unwinds and all that, all that jazz. <laughs> what is your favourite biology topic? Um, my favourite biology topic is homeostasis which we are doing at the moment because you get to find out how organs actually work in detail which was really fascinating. So why did you pick biology? So I chose biology as more of like a stepping stone between like GCSEs and university. So at university I would quite like to study marine biology and obviously biology is in the name of that so it was quite a good choice for me. And as well I enjoyed the subject so it was a nice one for me to carry on sort of through A levels and then into my future. What do you think was the most challenging aspect of biology for you? For me, the most challenging aspect about biology is taking concepts that we've learned and applying them to new situations. That could be a different environmental factor or a new animal species that we come across. Mm -hmm. And what was the one thing that you liked the most about biology? Um, most recently we've been doing a topic uh, and specifically inside that topic there's a thing called lap operon. So what's been the most interesting topic you have come across in biology? I really like studying the immune system because I found that just everything we've been learning is so interesting about resistance and antibiotics and antigens and everything. And like, it's been really great learning about at the moment vaccinations and everything. Obviously, linking to coronavirus situation nowadays, how we can spend some less time oh, just like talking about vaccination now and learning about how it really does relate to a situation that like scientists are working on right now. Um, what transferable skills have you gained from biology? So biology has definitely taught me to be resilient um, and this has, you know, translated into my other um, A-level subjects such as maths and chemistry and it's taught me not to give up if I don't get something right the first time um, and to keep working at it until I finally understand what I'm doing and I would also say that it's um, taught me how to be a better problem solver because Things might not be, you know, direct. You may have to think outside of the box, and that's okay. That is something you're going to have to do at A level, and yeah. What is the challenging topic you have come across in biology, and how did you overcome it? Um, the most challenging topic for me was biodiversity. I think because it's applying your knowledge to unknown contexts, which is a lot of all of my priorities. And also because the math schemes are very specific, but once you get used to that, once you get used to applying your knowledge to lots of different situations, which you haven't necessarily come across, then like, it does actually get much easier. Um, so what has been your favourite practical? Favourite practical would have to be the heart dissection, yeah. because um, I think you get to spend a lot of time, you know, actually doing it. It's not as rushed as maybe at GCSE and um, you learn about exactly where, what is and um, it's quite rewarding when you finally, you know, kind of get to see how this organ works and personally it was quite interesting but it was fun to be able to like actually get it right, like that's where that is. Exactly, it's not all just theoretical so I like that practical element.